The Jurassic Dead is a, a movie sent to me by Wild Eye releasing for review purposes. I have an Amazon link down below if you would like to purchase this film if you are interested and if you uh, consider my review uh, a worthy review, please give this video a thumbs up. The Jurassic Dead is basically about this um, zombie saurus. <laughs> it's about this mad scientist who creates this uh, dead, uh, no, creates a living dead T-Rex, and after he attacks people, after the dead T-Rex uh, attacks people, everybody turns into zombies. This was a over-the-top, stupid dinosaur movie. And was this trying to copy off of the Jurassic Park movie? Probably, but... These types of movies do not have the hundreds of millions of dollars. These have very low budgets. They do what they can with them. I'm going to talk about one here a little bit that I think had a little bit more budget to it, but here we go. The Jurassic Dead. The Jurassic Dead. The Jurassic Dead is all I already told you what it was about, but I'm a big fan of, um, I'm looking for the actor's name. I saw it before I started. Cooper Elliott. Cooper Elliott. He does a lot of films uh, that I've seen, um, particularly on uh, a few television program or on a few television TV shows. But this is probably his corniest performance to date. And by corny, I mean corny. Uh, good corny, pretty much. It's a good corny. <laughs> uh, this is a 82-minute U.S. film with a no region code locking with one bonus feature, which is trailers. And I will say that you, if you're interested in a over the top uh, horror esque action movie, then I would highly recommend it. this film if you're looking for top notch acting, uh, great special effects. They do what they can with the budget they had, which I'd say m m maybe was 20,000, 20,000, maybe 30,000 at the most. But, um, otherwise, this is not an amazing film, but I would say that this was one of the weaker films that they sent me, um, in my opinion, but I'm here to give you my honest review, and honestly, not every studio is going to put out, uh, top-notch content like Killer Camp Out, Countryside, and Karis Hill. So, I'm gonna give The Jurassic Dead a C- Minus. It was an okay film, just not amazing. I wanted more from it, but maybe my expectations were a little bit too high. Let's get into the next film in the next video, which is The Snarling.